Hello, St. Mary's New Haven. I'm Father Anthony Federico. I'm so excited to be part of this community. I'm gonna be one of the new priests on the team here. I'll be the parochial vicar of St. Mary's. And I'm so excited because I was born in New Haven and my connection to not only St. Mary's, but to Father McGivney goes back a long way. Um, I, was, I grew up in West Haven and North Haven. I went to Notre Dame of West Haven, played a bunch of sports there. Uh, oldest of five kids, Italian-American Catholic family. Then I went to Providence College where I was educated by some very fine Dominicans. And after Providence, I worked for about seven years as a sports writer and editor at ESPN until the Lord had a big change of plans for me. Uh, he called me to the priesthood through some tumultuous moments in my life. And I've been ordained a Catholic priest for two and a half years. I've never been happier in my whole life. Friends, I understand that there are some very strong feelings related to this time of transition. I've read a lot of the comments and, and the Facebook posts and stuff like that, and I get it. I get it, and it hurts to see this period of fracture. And so I can't fix those things right now, nor can Father Lerner, nor can anyone actually, but what I can offer you is myself. I pledge myself to you as a priest of Jesus Christ. I pledge to walk with you, to, to learn from you, to minister to you, to serve you. Whatever I can do to be a priest for you, that's what I can give you. And hopefully through this experience, you know, we'll come together and we'll experience the joy of living the Christian faith in a public way in the greatest city in the world, my hometown. From what I can understand and from, from the many people I've spoken with, St. Mary's New Haven is a thriving place that's just solidly Catholic. And all I can do is look forward to participating in that and contributing to that. Uh, and if I may say, I can't predict what the future will, help, will hold at St. Mary's New Haven, but I can guarantee there will be no tambourines. <laughs> so I'm super happy to be a part of this experience. I can't wait to meet you. And I want to tell you one quick story about our pastor, Father Ryan Lerner. When Father Lerner was ordained a priest, I had the privilege of serving his first mass as a seminarian and being invited to his ordination reception. He and I have known each other a long time. We overlapped in seminary for one year in Washington, D.C. And at his ordination reception, this you know tremendous celebratory occasion, he went missing for a while and no one could find him. And finally, when they were you know searching high and low for him, they found Father Ryan in the basement of the church in the kitchen doing the dishes so that other people wouldn't have to. I just think that story summarizes who our pastor is as a priest, as a man, as a Christian, as a leader. Father Ryan knows that true Christian leadership is not the authority of power, but the authority of service. And I have so much confidence in him to be our shepherd through this period of transition. Friends, he is a good man and he is a, a, a genuine disciple of Jesus Christ. So I look forward to joining him and meeting you and being part of St. Mary's New Haven. Thanks. Can't wait to meet you. Can I talk about pizza for a second? Please, yeah. Go ahead. Okay. I think I think if you want to make it, like yeah, I do. Yeah, do it. This is very important to me. Okay. As as someone who was born and raised in the New Haven, born in New Haven, raised in the New Haven area, I am a certified pizza expert, as many of you are. This is just a fact. When you're from this area by birth, you can have strong opinions on this matter. Now, my favorite pizza place in New Haven is Modern. That's great. I love Modern, but here's what's very important to me, and I, I have to communicate this to you. I firmly believe that you can love more than one New Haven pizza place. I love Pepe's, I love Sally's, I love Zupardi's in West Haven. There's a lot of great pizza in our town. You don't have to love just one of them. You can like more than one. Like, I prefer modern, but there's other great pizza too. So what I don't like is when people say, I like Pepe's, therefore I can't like any other pizza. No, it's, they're all good, but you can't have a preference. We can just enjoy them all. Thank you for listening to my TED Talk.